See, in the modern Christian trinity, the goddess has been removed and replaced with the dove. You have the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit represented as the dove, but there is no divine mother. The feminine has been removed and it's been replaced just by the symbol that the sacred feminine goddess was given in the ancient world, the dove, Kalun. Uh, now we're going to see a darker aspect of how the goddess uh, symbology is used when we look at things. I'll, I'll, I'll do this one since it's lighter first. You have here the, the moon and the dove because this is a sacrifice of how we use money through credit, building up debt. So you have the moon and the dove on the same card for Visa. And it's a symbol of the sacred feminine being used in a, in, a, in a depiction of sacrifice of an individual, sacrificing in a monetary sense. Here we see it being used in a very dark form as human sacrifice, because human sacrifice is still very real, very actively practiced in the world. It just isn't the practice of carrying people up a pyramid as, it, as how it was done in the past, or sacrificing them upon an altar with an obsidian blade or a dagger of some sort. Now, human sacrifice is carried out with the knowledge of everyone around us, and it is done willingly. People go off to sacrifice others and themselves in the act of war. War is modern day human sacrifice. And here you see the goddess with her wings depicted on a war memorial. And see, this is the goddess herself being sacrificed. A lot of researchers believe that it is them sacrificing people to the goddess. It isn't so much that they're sacrificing to the goddess. It's the reason the goddess is always depicted in conjunction with sacrifice is because they are sacrificing the goddess within an individual. It is the cremation of care, conscience, the protector, the, the grand architect of everything we experience is care. So this is the goddess herself depicted as being with these men as they are sacrificed along with the goddess. That's what war is. It's a, it's a ritual sacrifice of the sacred feminine in an act of sacrifice, of human sacrifice.